Okay, so in today's video, we're going to look at the fridge freezer. Um, now we operate this fridge as um, mostly just as a fridge. There is, as you can see here, um, a removable freezer compartment, um, but we tend not to use that. Uh, we prefer to have a little bit more space in the fridge just for um, general food items, milk and uh, vegetables and that sort of thing. So what we'll do is when you arrive to collect the van, we'll talk to you about your preferences and if you prefer to have the freezer, then we can easily uh, put the freezer compartment back in. So the operation of the uh, fridge freezer can be either um, on 12 volt, um, 240 AC or, or gas. 12 volt is really only for use um, when the engine is running. So if you're traveling from A to B, and um, the engine is, is obviously switched on, um, then the 12 volt can be used. Um, it will drain your batteries very, very quickly um, if the engine isn't on, so we certainly don't recommend that. Um, short term only maybe, but um, if you're in a campsite for any length of time, then you, you need to either be on uh, 240AC, which so you'd be plugged in uh, via the cable to the campsite, or if you're freedom camping, um, then you need to be on the gas. So I'll just take you through now the three different um, methods of operation and we'll begin with uh, how to use the fridge using the gas. Okay, so um, with the gas here, um, you basically you just need to remember obviously a couple of things. First of all, we need to have the 12 volt switched on and we have, as you can see on the uh, panel up there, I've already switched on the 12 volt. Secondly, um, obviously the gas bottle itself needs to be uh, switched on and for the purposes of this de demonstration I've already turned on the gas. So operation is pretty simple. Um, all we do basically is to press uh, the power on button here and we hold that for a couple of seconds until it comes on. Okay, and at the moment you can see it's defaulted to the last uh, use which was 12 volt when we uh, returned from our last trip. So I'm now going to change that and press the gas icon here. Uh, you may not be able to hear that in the background but I can hear um, the ignition system kicking in and so we are now using the gas bottle to run the fridge. Um, as you can see here uh, you've got the temperature gauge so at the moment it's set to a mid-range temperature um, that can just be adjusted by pressing this button here and selecting um, the, the level of, of um, temperature that you want so I, we would we normally have it on three uh, just depends what you what your preferences are so now we're going to look at um, AC operation so this will assume that you're already plugged into uh, 240 electricity uh, in a campsite for example. Um, again very simple, we press and hold the power button for a couple of seconds, the lights come on, it will revert to the last known power source and I'm going to change that now uh, to electric using this button here and that now is running uh, on the external 240 volt AC supply. So the final method of uh, fridge operation is on 12 volt. Um, but before I show you that, I'll just show you how to um, actually turn the fridge off. We normally turn the fridge off um, if we are running the engine and, and we're going to stop somewhere for a cup of tea or to do some sightseeing um, and, we wanna, and we haven't got AC supply and we know we're not going to be too long away from the uh, van, we normally just leave the fridge closed and um, turn the fridge off so that once the engine stopped the, the fridge isn't draining down the uh, the house batteries. So to turn off the fridge very simple um, you press and hold the power button and that turns the fridge uh, off completely. Okay so now we're going to just quickly talk about the 12 volt. Um, again this operation is exactly the same as all the others. Press and hold the power button and select the symbol here that looks like a battery. Now, it, you can see it's warning us here that the uh, engine isn't running. So. 
So I'm just going to turn off now the, the 12 volt just to get rid of that alarm. Okay, so that's it on the fridge. Um, nothing much more to add really. Um, you've got quite good storage in here. Um, as you can see, we, we put cheese and um, smaller items in here and butter. Um, but um, you've got a fair selection of, of shelving um, for all your different bits and pieces. Just one final thing to show you. Um, the fridge is opened and closed um, using these two buttons here. You just depress them in and that allows the fridge to open. It's just a mechanism to uh, lock the fridge door shut when you're, uh, when you're underway in the, in the van and um, it just stops the door from flying, flying open as you go around a corner or something like that. So just to shut it, just push it in and it will lock in place and that is now firmly in place and it won't open. That's the end of this particular video. We hope it's been useful. Check out our other handover videos on YouTube. To find us, just search for NZ Camper To Go and remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you're sure to get any updates or new videos that we add from time to time. That's NZ Camper, the number two, and go. You can also check out our Facebook page by searching for the same name. And if you'd like to like our page, that would also be great. If you've got any suggestions of how we can improve the information we're providing here, um, you can email that to us at nzcampertogo@gmail.com. at gmail.com. Thanks again for watching and goodbye for now. Mm -hmm.